Okay, today I'm going to be doing a uh, Apple Pencil for the Apple iPad Pro. Assuming I'm working on several other iPads, I'm not sure. This is doing this in 4K, 30 frames a second on a GoPro camera. Let's see how this turns out. Well, oh, there's a. Sorry if I've been spinning around so much. Give everybody vertigo. Here's what it uh, looks like in all the box and everything. And there's a tab right here at the very end on the, where the tip of the pencil's at. Once you take the plastic off, you just give this a little pull. I took the plastic off beforehand because it was wrapped really tight. So I'm going to lay this over here out of the way. I have not opened this yet. I hope something's in here. Uh, looks like I have some uh, brochure here. Oh, actually, it's uh, not only a brochure, but I got a tip. Uh, looks like I got the tip cover. It's a spare tip, actually. And I'm sure it's some kind of a extension to charge it with. I think. Oh, yeah, that's for a mail to mail adapter for it. There's a spare tip for the firewire. In case you want to charge it from a firewire instead of sticking it into the iPad, I suppose, what this is for. Lay this over here out of the way. I have the instructions here. It's this pencil. And uh, this around. See if I can open this up. Yeah, it opens up, it shows you how to. Uh, Charge the iPad. I have it upside down. Sorry about that. There we go. I'm filming this in 4K, so like I said, I have no idea. I can't really see the screen right now. It's the safety and handling, just uh, basic stuff. This over the way. And here is the pencil. I, oh, this falls out. And uh, it has uh, a piece of plastic here on it wrapped up, I guess, so it doesn't get scratched maybe during shipping. I'm sure I'm going to peel this off. Let's see what this does. Here it is, and uh, later on I will do a review of it. At this moment, I do not have an iPad that it'll work on. I have one currently ordered. So here's the tip. Just screws off. And uh, it's like a sensor in here. It's like a real ink pen, but it's not. I'm not sure if I should touch that sensor or not. Let's we'll screw this back in. So the tips screw in and out. If you mess one up, they have a spare, which is good. I'm not sure how much these tips run. You have to replace it. And here is the end of the pencil. This is where you charge it, plug it in. And that's where that adapter was for in case you want to charge it from a firewire to a USB. Put this back in. But it's magnetic, by the way. You don't have to use any foot. Yeah, it just pops right back in. Feels smooth. Feels like um, glass, but it's not some kind of hard plastic, I assume. Or maybe, no, actually steel, I think it's painted. So, let's see what uh, things in the bottom of the box. I, I always want to take everything out for whatever reason and see what it looks like in the box. Well, maybe I won't on this because it, look, it appears that it is... Uh, Maybe glued in. Yeah, it's kind of stuck in. It's not coming out. Well, I am going to put the pencil back into its uh, cover until a later time when I get my iPad in and I will be doing a review on it with an iPad. iPad Pro 12.10, I guess, or 9. Not sure what it is yet. Yeah. Well, I'm having trouble even getting it back in himself. So. There you go. This fits right back in here. And back into the box. And this is actually a rectangle. I'll show you the end of it there. It slides back in. Alright folks, like I said, I don't have a uh, iPad just yet. Hopefully UPS will be bringing it in the next few, or FedEx actually. 
Uh, I ordered one with my name engraved, so it is taking a little longer. But uh, I'd like to thank y'all for watching my video, and I hope everybody has a great day.